Hi, Andreas here from Big Cheese Business Coaching. Today I'm going to share a very important concept with you. It's called the be, do, have. Okay, it starts with, let's look at the have. We all want to have different things in life. And we also have what we have right now. So that's that's something that we can look at. Let's look at one concept here. And that is, say, say the money. It's an easy one to understand and, and a good one to start. Because we all understand what we have currently with money and we might not be happy with the situation and then we go back and easy one to look at is the do so now i'm looking at the do what am i doing to that that determines what i'm having right now say now i don't actually have any assets and i can then quickly see that what i'm doing is that i'm spending my money rather than investing my money Right, so this is the spend, and I might be spending that on a boat. I might be spending that on on lovely cars, going out often, and I might also be doing things such as not not putting any money aside. And so, at the end of the month, at the end of any period, all the money is gone, and my situation that I have here is pretty bleak because there's there no assets, no investments really, and. Now, I might decide that I actually want to have some assets here. So what might that be? So this could, for example, be things such as some property, some business. It could be some shares that I own in, in other companies. So these are all the type of assets that I can be having. So in order for me to have them, I have to probably do things a little bit differently. The challenge is this is quite difficult because, you know, I'm the person that I am. I'm I'm a spender, so therefore I'm spending, and it's difficult for me to get here. So this is where this comes in. I now have to look at who am I being. So here, up here, it's easy because I can say, okay, I am a just just looking realistically at, at what happens, so I'm, I'm rather a spender than a saver. And here, if I want to change that, I now have to go back here. And that's the beauty, because it's actually quite easy. All I need to do is like saying, okay, what do I need to do? So I need to obviously, maybe one of the th- simple things that I need to do, is I need to invest and save. So that would be one thing, save some money. And I also need to invest some money. Okay. So for me to do that, I have to be a different person, a different kind of uh, being. And the the being that I need to be is an investor. Aha. So as soon as I know that, that will probably, it gives me a good chance of doing that because I'm not going to do that unless I am an investor. Because as a spender here, unlikely that I'm going to invest, right? And as an investor, now I've got some clues here. So what do I need to do to become an investor? I probably need to study a little bit on what investors do. I might actually mix with, uh, surround myself with such people. So I spend a, you know, surround myself with, uh, join a investors club. There are exactly such things. I might read some books, right? I might listen to some CDs about investors. It's easy. Or DVDs, you can get many. Or YouTube videos, anything like that. Anything on investor, all of a sudden, I upskill myself and the chances are then I will learn and also get sort of into my unconscious mind the idea that I'm an investor, start looking at ways of saving money and investing money, and that in turn will help me have those things. So the formula actually goes like this, B times do equals have. So you can see here, if I just focus on that area here, And say now I'm zero investor here in my mind. Yes, I I think I'm going to do all those great things. I might put myself into a 10 here. 
chances are 0 times 10 gives me 0 and I'll, they, I will never reach that so I need to really really focus on that so the area one one more tip here this is also you see to, to be something I have to decide that I am a investor so the I am is very important it's also called an so from that I can make an in 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 a I am statement so I can say I am an investor and if I keep saying that to myself often enough I start believing that and then in turn my unconscious will help me to to do these kind of things because it's, there's always a the, the conscious mind and the unconscious mind and the unconscious mind is really the the thing that drives me towards doing the right things and to do that I can program myself so this probably takes you know that can take maybe up to 30 days of pro reprogramming myself instead of that doing that I am an investor I also need to change my surrounding if I keep wasting my time with other spenders guess what I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna have no money left at the end of any given period so there you have it this principle applies for virtually anything that you want to have this could be things such as um, you know you could have obviously money is one as we know money is not everything yet it's a very important starting point it could be things such as relationships Again, I might be saying, what am I doing here to have the relationships that I'm having right now? And then I need to perhaps change my being. And I'll give you a little um, personal example here. I wanted to have a really great relationship with my children because I see other people and, and not having such great relationships and I didn't want to go down that track. So... I looked at what I was doing and I probably found that I didn't spend enough quality time with my children and you know they were doing their things I was doing my thing and then one of the simple little things that I did I decided I'm going to be a better father so so once I did that I thought okay what are some of the things I can do as a as a really great father and that was to spend more quality time with my children and so what I did is put it in my calendar that I'm going to spend at least an hour or whatever it takes on a date with each of my children so on a one-on-one -on -one. and the things that we do we go for a walk and they can choose the type of things and if they don't sometimes I choose them too and uh, we go to movies or have dinner or just just spend quality time together and go for a walk on the beach or anything like that and the, the kids really like that and it's great for me we all love it and it really came about me making a decision here I am a great father and I'm gonna do spend quality time with my kids and then the relationship comes by itself I didn't need to really focus on this area all I needed to focus on is this area so there you have it have fun with this. Try it out by yourself. Make a list of I am statements and think of which are the really important things. You should maybe have five, no more than ten I am things that you want to focus on. And you can write them down. Put them on your shower, on the outside of your shower or on your dashboard of your car or on your wallet so that you look at that and, and keep saying them out aloud. At first it sounds a little bit sort of geeky, but hey, that, that's always the things that we start for the first time. Once you've done it and you feel the power of it, you will look back and see how amazingly powerful this concept is. I wish you all the best and great luck.